All right, boys. Welcome back to New Jimmy A Plays, and yeah, this scheme <laughs> looks familiar, don't don't it? Um, McDonald's Treasure Land Adventure. I'm playing again, but this time I'm going to talk to you all, the people, throughout the whole thing. Uh, you know, the day of recording this, this will be the third time that I've. Uh, played and beaten it within a week, so... <laughs> it's a really fun game. I just discovered it recently in the Sega Genesis. Oh, well, actually, off my Retroid Pocket 3, it's on the Sega Genesis. Um, there's a password feature, but the game's so short. I've only played it on normal. I'm not ready for expert just yet. Um, let's just get started with, uh, level 1. Okay, that Fuck. You don't have much time. Um, if you want to check out my uh, video, my last time I played this, just recently I released it. Um, I did not, it was just, you know, gameplay, audio, I wasn't talking at all in it. So, if you want to check that out, I will post that video in the uh, description below. This is a fun fucking game. What are you doing? You're Ronald McFucking Donald, and you're going around. You're getting a, uh, you're looking for these fucking maps, and once you put the map together, you go to the moon, and those are the, the bad guys. The villains. And, um, you go to the moon, and, yeah. So, <laughs> it's a very short game, and it's very, very easy, especially on normal. I, I, it's so fucking easy. Uh, anyhow, let's start stage one, magical forest. So, let's do it. Again, I am playing this off my Retro Pocket 3 Plus. I do not own the actual cart of this game. Um, it's actually a little pricey. Like last I checked, in January of 2023, this game off of price charting. Uh, is going around 90 bucks, I think. Complete set's gonna be north of 100. I mean, it's not terrible by any means, but for a McDonald's game, come on, you really must spend 90 bucks for it. If I get it, it, it it's probably gonna be uh, a bootleg or something, as long as it works. Controls are pretty, um, oh shit. Controls are pretty uh, easy. There are times where I'm just, uh... Shit. Like, sometimes I feel like the, the controls are not responsive enough. And sometimes it's a little hard to hit the fucking... <laughs> the shit. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, whatever, let's go this way. So you want to get the money bags... Two... Um, yellow flowers will get you, I think, a health, health bar. Three white flowers will get you one. Um, we want to buy... I first want to get the life jewels. The life items, which will give you more... Um... Crystals to carry. But we gotta get more money bags. I don't know exactly how every item here works. Um, obviously, the Ronald McDonald face is your life. The McDonald sign is continues. The balloons are, um... I don't see, extra life. The balloons are, I guess if you fall off the stage, you get these balloons. Um, and the white little sparkly thing below the um, balloon is your magic power. I think three is the max you can carry. Let me turn this down. 
You know, I, I believe one of my testing out games off the of Super Console X, off the, um, I think it was the, uh, second, well, obviously the second Genesis one. I think it was. I think I did play this game for a little bit. I remember I really liked it, but I never sat down and played it. Oh, shit. Those jewels are, uh, health. We gotta get more, more, uh, life jewels. Yeah, but I always wanted to play this game. It's never took the time to play it, so. God damn it, Ronald McDonald! See, first game over. I'm a little exhausted, <laughs> to be honest with you. I just played this game and I just finished it up. And, uh, yeah, not a long game. Not, not really. Uh. Yeah, fuck you, no. Good. Yeah, we want the health pieces. We gotta buy more life jewels. We're gonna get more as soon as we hit the uh, McDonald's store. Whatever the fuck one can, whatever the fuck one's at. I didn't see that guy there. Okay, we got, uh... I'm gonna go the long way around. Okay, so we should be good. Enemy respawning is not terrible in this game. I think some spots they will respawn, but it's not, like... I don't know. It's not terrible. At least not in a normal difficulty. I would like to try some expert one of these days. Come on, you stupid fish. That's a power up, I want that. Oh shit, this thing? I'm trying to fuck with. Another room that's like this at the, at the game room. I have no idea how to really do the game. So I usually ignore it. Oh, look, we got enough life jewels. We don't need to buy any uh, life items, I should say. We don't need to buy any more, so. Shit, hit the wrong button. <laughs> Go back in. Okay, so we're full health. I noticed that I, I didn't really have to buy many items because you find a lot of shit throughout the game level. For the damn game, so you might have a lot of money by the end of the game. I imagine that store will be more useful on export mode. Hi, oh, you fucking motherfucker. That's all right. Yeah, I do want that Ronald McDonald extra life. Ha <laughs> ha I just 
don't know where exactly it's at. There it is. Oh, shit on my tits. There's the goal. Get the balloons. You really want the balloons, guys. So we have one balloon. We're gonna find more. Frogs are good. I fucked up. See, I popped that balloon right away. All because I was trying to go back and get that fucking star. Or the flower. God, get the fucking balloon, you asshole! I'm getting too cocky. God damn it. I'm getting too careless, too. Our star power ain't gonna go up anymore. Or our magic power. The strongest, this is what you want, boys. What if we go up, up here? What's up here? Nothing? Okay, right, oh, here we go. This might be a game room. I guess I'll do it once. It's like one of these Pyro Pyro games. I guess the skull's a bad thing. I should have done the uh, different way. I really hate how to hear my work radio all the way in my bedroom. I have to fucking listen to it. <clears throat> Shouldn't be going off when I'm uh, home. And it's not even turned on. I actually signed off for that. I don't know why I'm still hearing voices. Okay, well, that doesn't work. That's great. Sucks. This actually may be the hardest part in the game. I'm done. Uh, no. <laughs> I'm fucking done with that. That should not be a test your bitch challenge. Alright, I will not uh, be playing that ever again. At least not this playthrough. Until I'm actually fucking good at, uh, at it. I know what I'm fucking doing, and I don't know what I'm doing in that. <laughs> yep, I guess the fish is, uh... Okay, I need 
gonna go up here. <laughs> Alright, here we go, boys. Okay, try to collect some items. But watch out for these uh, motherfuckers that are gonna stab you. <laughs> There's not many items here, and I already missed like two or three of them. Watch out. Wait, no, it's in the part I'm thinking of. <clears throat> Not good. That was the first time I ever got caught in that, uh, in that waterfall. I missed it. Here's the goal. Does anyone want any McDonald's? Because I certainly don't. I can't stand McDonald's. They uh, redid the McDonald's um, near my job, and I haven't gone there yet. The whole building and everything, and I always wonder what it's like, but. Okay. I haven't gone there yet. I haven't gone inside a new building. It isn't that hard to get up there. I think it only took me like a couple tries to get up there, and I'm gonna try it one more time. So if I don't get it this time, I'm just gonna move on. But I really do want the money bags. I really, really want the money bags. Shit. Want the shop up there? I don't think we need anything. We can't really get anything right now anyways. Okay, so for my last playthrough, I skipped this part. Hamburglar, am I ever glad to see you? What's that you say? Oh, you want two of my magic jewels? What's that? You say you'll give me a hint for the jewels? Really? Let's just give him some jewels. Who gives a shit? Let's see what happens. Hmm, you say the enemy bosses will try to steal my magic <laughs> Shit that I fucking know. Oh, I can attack them while they're eating the jewels. Really? Thanks, Hamburglar. I'll give it my best shot. Well, I still have two of my jewels back. I don't know what the hell happened. 
Alright, it should be the boss coming up oh, very soon. Yeah, you don't want to get hit because you'll, you'll get fucked up. Here's a boss. Boss is stage one. He's very easy. Okay, yeah, watch out for his minions. I'm gonna take the jewel. Oh shit. Okay, I missed him. How did I miss? There we go. He's, he's done. Down and out for the count, boys. Very easy fight. I just, I'm just kind of tired of playing this game. Ouch! Ow! Ow! You win, Ronald. Yeah, we kicked that tomato's ass, or that fucking whatever the whatever the hell he is. Ronald looks so creepy. Second part of the map, and continue his adventure. The train level, boys. Magic Town Stage 2. So I can't confirm when or how. Um, but I'm guessing you would get the password to each stage after you... Get the game over? Again, I, I can't confirm because I've never had a game over yet in this game. It is uh, one of the easiest, easiest games I've ever played in my life. And I am not a good gamer. You see some of the games that I play and how I play them. I'm, I'm not... Great. Um, <laughs> but this game, I'm just, I fly right through it. There's three times I- third, 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 third time I'm playing it in a fucking week. I'm just kind of over it. I really want to save some up for the, um, continues and shit. Once we get to the moon, you're gonna see it, it's, it's gonna spike up a little bit in difficulty. Jump back up there and get that up. Continue, but I just wasn't pay really paying attention. Yeah, there's gonna be some of those I'm probably gonna miss. Like that up there, it's gonna be hard to get. Yep, I missed it. Can't get back up there. 
Alright, I like to call these the cat paws. If you're not careful, they'll get you. And the last time I went through this, of course, I was perfect. Oh, it's a game, and I'm not playing this game again. I'm done with that game. Oh, I'm trying to get grabbed by these little twats. You see, I just got grabbed by them. They're hard to dodge. I don't know how to really get past this part. I don't know how to really break free of it either. God damn you, Ronald. See, this is a case where some of the enemies are going to respawn. But sometimes it works in your favor because you can just farm them for health points if you need it. Alright, what's this lady's name? Birdo? Help me, Ronald. I've been kidnapped by a wicked circus owner. I don't know my uh, McDonald's character. I could break the lock on his pen if he only has some magic jewels. So there's only two really good McDonald's games that I know. One of them is obviously this game. The other one is MC Kids. I've never beaten MC Kids yet. It's my goal this year to beat it. When you hear that, duck. So we got five balloons. I'm just gonna keep jumping until we can't jump anymore. Never know what you're gonna fucking find. Now we're falling. Okay. This part is a little tricky. You just gotta be a little patient. I may not get that balloon, which I don't really give a shit at this point. I always usually miss this one. So I'm usually waiting for the bitch to fucking move. And when you're using that balloon, don't hit the A button, just kind of move the joystick or the control pad up. It's eventually going to put you back on uh, land or whatever, eventually, you know, just be quick. Be smart. Okay. This is a boss fight up here. Or a mini boss fight. He's a little tricky. He's not terrible. Huh, well that was pretty easy. I was ready to get his hat, because I used to, I wear his hat during the fight, but okay, whatever. Thanks, Birdo. I don't know your name. Uh whew, that was close. Next time be more careful. Good luck, Ronald.
Okay. It's a pretty big update on the uh, Twitter. Have to see why it was. Uh, what's going on? Okay. Sometimes I don't know why he doesn't hit him. Those things don't die. Can we buy anything? Nope. What? Yeah, no, we're good. Yeah, they uh, do that. <laughs> they do that. All right, let's just get out of here. I don't want to fuck around anymore. There's a boss fight right here. Ronald McDonald anymore. Uh, no more um, penthouses or uh, play ball pits, whatever the fuck you want to call them. Uh, no more commercials. Like nothing Ronald McDonald anymore. Like it doesn't fucking he's not the mascot anymore. It's weird. Cause kids are really afraid of clowns. What's what uh, Pennywise will do to you? Please, stop crying. <laughs> He's just so polite. Ronald, he tried to kill you. Thanks, kid. Oh, there's the map. There's the map. There's the map. There's the map. Alright, so he just gave me the next map for the uh, next stage. Pops on a balloon and sets sail for... What is this? Stage 3, Magical Sea. Okay. This one I'm gonna die a couple times. Right there. And right there. And right there. That's why we had the balloons. God damn it. That thing's gonna sauce in half. I just jump over it, and god damn it, I lost two balloons in one shot! Tidal wave should take us in a second. Oh shit! That was a little difficult part. 
again, make sure you collect the balloons. That's all I can say. Collect the goddamn balloons. That's a bad guy. Oh, those green things are, are good, so... Oh, come on, I thought I could ride your back. Alright, I'm gonna need to use one of those clouds. Yeah, I tried attacking them. I thought I had to kill them all. Cause the very first time I played this, I had no idea what I was doing here. I didn't realize how to do this. Oh uh, yeah, so I was attacking those green things, trying to kill them all, and I was like, oh, what the fuck do I gotta do here? God damn it! Stop blocking my shit! Don't grab those brown coconuts. I mean, you can grab them. You can grab them if you want, but they just fall down, so. And I don't know if they're gonna hurt you or not. Probably best not to try. I'm not gonna find out. Alright, so. Let's get another M. Continue. Money bags are important, boys. It's like TL All Star gift and bits of glory during the live streams. It makes an impact. It really does. No matter how big or small the money bag is. Alright, you know, you've seen this guy before. He is a boss. Coming up. He's a little annoying, but he's not terrible. Uh, excuse me? That's probably a, a game shop. During my last playthrough, I didn't mean to go to the very top right away. I wanted to, uh... Explore a little bit, get these, uh... Items. And when I say items, I mean money bags. I think I'm done. Yeah, we don't need that jewel. You know, as fun as this game is, I really can't spend any dollars on this fucking game. <laughs> the game will probably cost... I don't even know how people got it back in the day. I know McDonald's toys were a fucking lot cooler than they are today. Which I can't confirm if they never got a kid's meal in a while. Did they throw video games in there? Okay. 
part is a little tricky. God damn it. I say just take your time. And it's practically a maze. These doors are kind of useless. There we go. We got a heart piece right there. Or a jewel piece. Here's a shop. Which we're okay for now. So I may have to go back to that shop. Watch out for these sliding things. Stick it up there. Ah! Sight. Come on, Ronald. Get the fuck up there, bro. Alright, we got the jewel piece. Let's just get out of here. There's the goal. We're done with this part. I, I want to see a Bits and Glory Deathless run of McDonald's Treasure Land. If Jimmy A can beat this game, I, I think Bits and Glory can have no fucking problem beating this Deathless. On the extreme difficulty. Oh, sorry. Fuck. Duh, G Ronald, I'm so tired I can barely move. Here, take some of my jewels. Uh, gee, Ronald, thanks. I feel much better. So yeah, I'm not familiar with McDonald's characters. Grimace? Is that his name? And what the hell is he supposed to be? A giant chicken McNugget? It was more like Barney. Okay, um... Two jewels. You know, at the time of recording this, there's only two Sega Genesis games I've ever beaten. <laughs> Sega Genesis is actually really challenging, and I want to make it a goal in 2023 to beat more Genesis games and eventually put them on the channel. Um, Shining Force, obviously, is one of them, and this game's the other one, obviously, so... Um, it is a challenge, it is a goal to uh, get more Genesis games up here. Genesis is nowhere near Super Nintendo. It doesn't fucking matter. There's some games that are great. This game's actually a good game. It's a pretty damn good game. Uh, I think Aladdin? Or was it Jungle Book? I don't want to remember which one it was. It could be both of them, actually. Uh, the Genesis version of that game is better than the SNES. But other than that, I haven't really beaten anything. It is a goal of mine to beat more, so... Hopefully stay tuned to the channel. Best way to stay on of that is uh, join my Discord, which you can find in my uh, YouTube bio. This thing, he just kind of... He challenges you, but just push him. He'll just jump off and kill himself. Okay, last minute shopping. Let's get another, um... Continue item. I did not know the max to carry any of that. The only thing I know a max of is the uh, magic power, which has to be three, I think. 
I do think this is the boss. Yep. A little bit of pain in the ass. Really, bro? Let's throw his hat, so... I do think when you die, you do lose a, uh, a magic power, so... jump this way. Shit. Well, there was our chance to hit him some more. Oh, now you gotta jump this way. Fuck this guy, yo. <sighs> I think it's complete random with which direction he faces in. I can't confirm. See, now he's gonna face my way again. Again, not a pain in the ass, but he's quite annoying. Oh, I'm sorry, not difficult, but he's quite a pain in the ass, so. There we go, he's dead now. Yeah, the bosses are really quite easy. Just, you know, follow their pattern, see what they're doing. Sometimes it'll be a little lengthy. This one's a little lengthy. Not terrible. The pirate, the one on the, on the, on the pirate ship, the, um, the moon. This is the pirate ship one. The one on the moon, he's a little bit of a, more of a pain in the ass. Sometimes he'll be blocking fucking doors that you have to be going through to hit him. But more on that when we fight him. We're going to go to the last level now. Get all the map pieces. Twitch, who went live? Von Miller! So I believe Freak went live. Oh, Freak is live. Okay, let me turn my volume down. This freak will, uh, freak spot the guy that will sue me for, uh, using his voice and shit on my YouTube page. So I'm gonna lurk. That guy sued Bits and Glory before. Oh my god, Who the fuck's this guy? He's not a McDonald's character. Isn't the hamburger a bad guy? Five, four, three, two, one, zero, blast off.
He goes to the moon, but how the hell does he get back? Because, boom, spaceship <laughs> fucking crashed. So, gee, we're on a crash landing. Where's your fucking space helmets? Don't tell me we'll be stuck on this moon forever. Oh, you're gonna have to be. Come on, everybody, cheer up. There's gotta be something I can do. <laughs> cheer up, okay. Why don't we all split up and look for someone to help us fix the ship? Final stage, stage four, magical moon. Okay, let's wrap this up because I want to feed my cat. It's actually pretty late in the day. The moon is the most difficult part. It's like every other fucking video game with the moon in it. The most difficult part. I am just, uh, I've been a little bit more careless this, uh, playthrough. Apologize. I don't think I was this bad on my, uh... Last time I played it, like, no commentary one. This part is a little tricky. Just try to get through here as quickly as you can. I just say fuck it and just go through it. Okay, so that might. Uh, I was gonna say that was probably the hardest part. Sometimes it's hard to tell if it's a life piece or if it's a, uh... Ah, shit. Or if it's um, a life jewel, which the jewels at this point in the game are useless. Because we're already at max jewels! Maybe on the expert mode it'll mean more. Some, we'll buy some of that. So we're go really good on everything else. At this point in the game, you know, since our stats are really good, uh, I'm just more worried about health and jewels and shit, so... Get the fuck out of here, you motherfucker! I do want that. Here we go, goal, goal! Pay attention, this is not difficult, it just chops up the lane, you gotta jump to the next part. Oh god, you know, my retro pocket's actually close to dying. I hope it doesn't die during this playthrough. Please let me fucking beat this part. Let me beat this game before anything dies. I'm so close to the end. There's the goal. Now we're going to the spaceship. He's gonna grab me. He's gonna tickle my fancy. Oh, run, run, run! <laughs> he got me good. 
Now we're going to get that old alien probe. I see why Ronald McDonald is no longer the mascot of McDonald's. But getting an alien probe, it has to be not as bad as um, having Jared Fogel as your fucking mascot. Am I right, Subway? And yes, I uh, I hate Jarrett, but I absolutely love Subway. Fucker. I don't remember which way to go. Come on! What the fuck, man? Come on, what's this fucking thing that's gonna crush me? Uh, too late to get it. Oh well. I think we got enough balloons. Okay, let's kill that. Robot. I really want the money back instead of uh, the flowers, but. Gotta have the right one show up, like this one right here. I don't need to stop at the shop right now. Okay. Uh, well, fuck me, right? Get out of here, brah! No, I'm gonna go another one. I usually, uh, go through up the right way. Actually, no, because I played this game three times. Two times on the left it came up. Well, sometimes we gotta make sacrifices, boys. Alright, these things are a fucking pain in the ass. They got these big-ass lips and they want to blow you, so... Was Ronald maybe down with that, so... Well, the hamburger definitely is. I don't know about Ronald. These things, uh, and guys, I don't want no little kids watching my videos. These things, I don't know if we have to attack them and the water disappears, but... Okay, yeah, there is a balloon over here. But I want to go that way. So we got eight balloons. We got more than enough balloons. Shit. Let that thing do its let that platform do its thing. I'm gonna go up. Let's see if he runs out. Oh he runs out, okay. And once he runs out, I just kill him. I never went straight up before. There's just some items up there that you can grab. I don't really give a shit. I just wanna... 
not deal with it if I don't have to. I imagine on Expert, it's probably worth going over and getting, but... We're not playing on Expert, we're playing on Easy. Or Normal. <laughs> whatever, whatever difficulty this is. Look at that, hanging on by a fucking thread, boys. This part's a little annoying, just pay attention best you can. I'm not paying attention. Again, I'm not really paying attention. Alright, we reach our goal. This part is a little bit of a pain in the ass. Uh, the rest of the game's a pain in the ass. Again, let's get as many balloons as we can get. I thought I was going to go back around because I kind of wanted that balloon. <laughs> you never know when you're going to need them. Like this part, I'm probably going to need them coming up. But fuck it. I mean, we're up here already. Alright, it's starting to piss me off a little bit. So you erase it, fucking balloons. They haven't gone back to their, uh, regular spot. They haven't reset it, so that, that's why I'm a little, uh, confused. I'm not hitting them anymore. Good, we got another Ronald McDonald life. This part kind of sucks. Shit, Ronald. Come on, bro. Oh, great. All this for a fucking game. Again, balloons are good. Pay attention. So they will shoot you off. I do not know of any warning signs of when they fall. Or where they'll fall. But when they fall, just jump. As soon as you see it, jump. Who are you? Wait a minute. You're not that wrong clown, are you? Aren't you? Well, you only know one clown that's pretty magical is Ronald McDonald. Try to get the kids there to get him fat. I give him the chores. Like me. McDonald's used to be the tits. And then I grew up. I was like, this shit sucks. A true story. I will tell you this story. The apartment that I'm currently living in, I lived here with my brother for about a year, two years. Um, 
And, you know, this used to belong to my uh, uncle, he passed away. Uh, so my aunt asked us to move up here and just, you know, help pay the rent and shit. So we did, and clean it up, and this is how I met Kitty. Well, I knew Kitty was here the whole time, but this is how I got to know, no, 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 Kitty. Um, so my old bedroom was set up, and we had McDonald's, and we brought him over to the apartment after we were cleaning, done cleaning it up. We were sitting on the bed. Kitty was laying in the bed. We had a chicken McNugget, a small piece of chicken McNugget, and a small piece of French fry. And that fucking cat ate that shit. <laughs> I've never seen a cat eat McDonald's food before. Well, yeah, I said yes. What is that all? Are you serious? Great, I gotta find more jewels. Ah. <sighs> So I gotta go over here now and buy some. And ever since then I gave Kitty uh All the good wet food and shit. She eats the good shit now. She won't even eat that shit anymore. I won't even feed her that shit anymore. Please don't feed your animals fucking McDonald's. Please don't feed your kids McDonald's either. Please don't feed yourself McDonald's. But if you want to play this fucking game, I say go for it. Great. Wasn't paying attention. Yeah, only this part is when I want to scratch my nose and shit. Ah, I wasn't paying attention. Ah, I scratched my nose again. God damn it. See, it's a complete random. It doesn't know when it's gonna come. There's no warning sign, is there? But my eye itches. Here's your fucking jewels, man. Get the fuck out. I give her three. Okay, so we saved the fried kids, but are those supposed to be French fries? Because they look like fucking. I don't know. All right, mini boss. Okay, time for the final boss. I think we're more than good. Keep in mind this final boss is a final pain in the ass. So watch the doors. My advice, don't be greedy. Do one hit, get the fuck out of there. You don't want to be trapped in there when he shoots that fireball off. It will take away a lot of jewels. Now watch what door he goes through. So he's gonna be in the stage below us. Kill this thing, collect the flowers. One hit, get up there, don't fuck around. There's no way we can lose that extra all these lights we have and shit. Watch what door he goes through. Okay, now get this one, get the fuck off the state floor with him. Let's kill this thing again. 
He's got three flowers, so he's gonna give us another jewel. And sometimes he'll block a door that you need to go through, which doesn't really help you, so... That's why, one of the reasons why in one of my, um, fights with this fucker... The last time I fought him took, uh, too long. He was just blocking doors that you need to go through. What's that? What do you want to call that? RNG? Is that how we say it? Bad RNG. Don't be greedy. I think only one hit does it anyways. But again, don't be trapped with this motherfucker. Okay, so now we, we can't do anything because he's right above us. I do try to get to the floor with the monster in it so I can, uh... Okay, I'm gonna go to the top. See, he's blocking the door. Let's see what I can do, actually. I only did that because, uh, I had a little couple extra rules to spare. But I don't want to do that again, though. Okay, he's going to the bottom floor, so we should stay up top. Again, he's blocking the- no, he's not. He's blocking one of the doors. There we go. Beat the game. Yeah! Here we go, we see what the treasure is. Was it worth it, Ronald? Was it worth it, bro? Think try to kill you, Ronald. Think twice. Huh, <laughs> hamburger. So ends another fun adventure for Ronald and his friends. And maybe. Probably the last time in a while I'm gonna be playing this game. I mean, three times in one week, I beat this game twice <laughs> today. Uh, I'm just a little tired now. Yeah, you know, what can I say? It's a fun game. It's a really, really fun game. I really, really enjoyed it. I'm probably never going to buy it for $90 for this game. But, you know, maybe I will look for like a bootleg version or something like that, not authentic. As long as it works, I definitely wouldn't mind adding it to my collection. I would say, yeah, give it a shot. You know, me, I, I download it to my Retroid Pocket 3 Plus, you know, and then it's just, it's been one of the, probably been the game that I played the most. Nah, probably not the game I played the most. But yeah, it, it's, it's one of the, it's one of the best games I've played on it, so. The second ever Sega Genesis game, to my knowledge, that I've beaten from start to finish. Shining Force being one of them. Very basic, very easy. Again, on the normal settings, I, can't, I, I imagine Expert's going to be a little bit harder, but... I'm sure it's very beatable, and I would like to try it on Expert one of these days. I need a break from this game. <laughs> Maybe I played through it right now. No, that's not gonna happen.
Not a fan of McDonald's, don't care for McDonald's, don't really care for fast food in general. But the game is fun. So don't eat at McDonald's, but you play this game. That's all I'm gonna say. If I can beat it, you can probably beat it, because I am not good at these games, so. Well, I'm not good at games in general. If I can beat a game, you can beat a game. It's the kind of game where I am. I play fucking Madden on easy, for Christ's sakes. Uh, see you. Adorable. Okay, now I do want to go... Confirm this price. Yeah, the PAL Mega Drive. Uh, loose copy is going for $91.39. The box is $71.25. Complete set is $178.06. I'm not paying near $200 for this game, hell no. The manual is something that I would be interested in collecting, but it's still pretty pricey at $44.53. And some of these people psh, are selling this game fucking eBay. This guy has it on eBay for $54. The listing has been removed. <laughs> okay. Because you're probably getting ripped off. Anyhow, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Check out the other video with non that I wasn't talking at all during it, if you want. Yeah, totally up to you. Um, you all enjoy the rest of your day, and I will see you next time, boys.